we've already discussed some of the basic hardware that you need to get started. All schools require some set of software applications, both for students and faculty, to be integrated effectively into their programs. These applications generally include software for word processing, spreadsheets, presentation software, web browsers. You're expected to have the basic understanding of these, these tasks, sending and receiving emails, uh, file attachments, of course using the internet. So here's a few software, software requirements that you'll need to um, make sure you're successful, like a word processing program like Microsoft Office, Word, Excel, PowerPoint, um, and a much more. You need to be able to download and send back assignments to students, and this is what most, most schools use. Some schools do offer some significant discounts for teachers um, and specific websites. And one of the my favorite websites is gradware.com. They give you a discount in, uh, on uh, software, and uh, you can verify that you work for the school, and they'll give you a discount. You may also consider a free program. That's called openoffice.org. This allows limited functionality of programs, but you can also uh, save them in Microsoft format. I really wouldn't recommend using this being a primary, but if it's a temporary solution, until you get the software you need, feel free to use that. A compatible web browser such as Firefox, Safari, or Internet Explorer, because um, you've got to be able to get to their site somehow. Uh, some of those browsers, like I mentioned earlier, Google Chrome uh, may be having issues, or uh, Safari used to have issues with getting to eCollege, um, not so much these days and of course having a proper operating system, um, a Windows XP or OS X for Mac. It's, a, it's important for you to understand that check in school, what, see what the school provides you, and many of them don't these days because of the economy and uh, they're kind of cutting back, but make sure you have the programs. Um, take advantage of the uh, discounts. You know, you're going to be purchasing your things. Uh, make sure that you, you know, take advantage of ta uh, any discounts and tax write-offs and you know get these software programs these software programs to help you with your teaching you know we'll, in some of the other videos we'll get in more in depth in these videos specifically um, how to use them away and how we can use them to make your life a lot easier